Welcome back to more Realm of Thrones, our Westerlands adventure, where we are getting pretty damn close to kicking off and seeing if we can forge our own kingdom and claim, at the very least, Lannisport and Castle Rock. Um, after which, if we're gaining a lot of momentum and everyone's still enjoying it, we'll keep on going to try and wipe out the Lannisters or the Westerlands faction. If it's impossible or just a grind and not a lot of fun, we'll settle for claiming Lannisport and Castle Rock. So we are currently gathering our force up together. We need to go get Hodor, don't we? Where where is Hodor? Who who saw me Hodor? That's my lovely banner. I didn't mean to press that button. Hodor. Is a fugitive and doesn't want to be found. Oh. Oh, he's escaped from he's just escaped from captivity. Okay, we'll give him some time. Right. What we're gonna do though is I think we're gonna pop on over to Essos to grab some unsullied to give to Brienne, because there were quite a few suggesting we do that. Give her some unsullied. Then I want to build up my army once more with Westerlands only troops. I like that actually for Brienne, we can give her a Tarth Man at Arms. There we go, it fits. Um we got Tyrion as quartermaster. Bronn as the scout. Yeah. Jamie is our surgeon. And I'm the engineer because there's basically nobody else to do it. Apart from Tyrion, but he's busy being quartermaster. Um, so yeah, we need to pop out Brienne and Hodor. One one's going around, which is fine. Um, so yeah, let's let's head on over then. I guess. I mean, we could we could pop by White Harbor actually and recruit some more troops from there. We, we were just throwing in some northern troops if I... <clears throat> yeah. Was not, mis not, mis not mistaken for Brienne. Uh, we won't get on our dragon just yet. We'll chill. We've, we've dragoned a fair amount. I'm just going to grab whatever I can to fill up our coffers right now. Although, actually, then I'd have to send out Brienne. You know what I'll do? I'm going to go dump a load of troops into Harrenhal. Then we'll go over. Because then I could just fill up on Unsullied. Yes, we'll do that. Head down to Harrenhal. Dump everyone in there. Go over, get some Unsullied, then come back. Will I pick up some Giants of War? Um, I probably should do, but that means going all the way north. And actually, the last time we tried finding him, we couldn't find him. But I think they have patched that now. Um, so, maybe... At some point, 1-1 one -one should have some giants. Oh, 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 oh. What's going on here? The Reach want to make peace. Sure. Mace Tyrell knows when to bend the knee to the Lions of the West. Yeah, this campaign we've pretty much used to kind of explore some features, check out the mod. We've had some fun with it. We've, we've you know, we've achieved a fair amount. We've got a few more bits that I want to do. And then, yeah, we will, we will probably bring this one to a close once we've tried to, at minimum, claim Castle Rock and Lannisport. And then our main focus will be carrying on our King in the North run. Um... And then probably once we finish King in the North, we will then do a Lost Targaryen series. Oh, that is Lysa Aaron. Yeah, of course, you've finally joined the war or joined the realms against us. You're not strong enough to beat us, but if you pick off some of our smaller forces bit by bit, you might be. Where is her army? Because if she were to siege Harrenhal, that would be... Oh, she's chasing Stafford Lannister. Is she going to siege it? She is. Okay, well, I mean, I wouldn't mind the siege defense at some point. Uh, not that there's custom maps in yet, but um, let's chuck all my troops in here. Um, I will actually chuck everyone in. Oh, I can't chuck everyone in. Why not? Oh, seriously, why can't I have more? Wall size. Oh, great. Okay, undo that. Um, oh, I mean, it was the Unsullied I just chucked in. Okay, well, let's just chuck chuck in all the random stuff I've picked up. Mm 
and then fill ourselves up after. They can have two unsullied. There we go. Away we go. I will sail out from King's Landing, I guess. Oh, and I need to sell more stuff as well, actually. I've got a load of stuff still. Why are we taking War and Bravos? But fine. Okay. <clears throat> what I'm actually hoping... There was a suggestion about when I leave the Westerlands, should I attack somewhere else and claim a bit of a base first? I'm kind... I'm like potentially tempted, but... I'm also thinking that while they're all distracted attacking lots of other different places, that's when I make my move on their home settlements. Although, damn, that's got a lot of militia. Seized them for a very long time. <clears throat> so I don't really know. I don't know exactly how I'm going to kick off. Like whether I go in, like some suggestions where I go conquer the su Summer Isles. Um, or like go down to Dawn, take some of that, and then have a southern kingdom and march north. But I haven't, I haven't fully decided yet. I haven't fully decided yet. By leaving the kingdom, that won't immediately make me go to war, will it? So, should be okay. Days, all this stuff. Good thing King's Landing is loaded. Yeah, militia are extremely flammable. That that is true. Militia be very flammable. This is true. Would like to get some more Lannister armor rather than the fine Tarly Lord stuff, but I quite like it if I'm going rogue now. Oh, we gained so much stuff from, like, wiping out the armies. Damn, son. That is a tasty amount. Uh, also, you guys are saying, please get rid of some of your grain. In fact, let's get, let's get rid of all of it. And then we don't need anywhere near that much grain. Yeah, you guys have been saying, Lionheart, the grain, please. Um, we've got plenty of fish. Uh, let's give them some... Let's take all the grapes of King's Landing. Um, let's take all their beer as well. And all their cheese. Yeah, that Because the more different food types you have, the better the morale improvement will be through food variety. Right, off we go. So we just need to head over to Estepor. Orath is no more. Dun, dun, dun. Where, where even were you guys? I don't actually know. Oh, we're not sailing at King's Landing. Where are we going now? We get the opportunity. Arthur, Arthur Keltigar has a Valyrian steel axe. Ooh, who? Which faction's he? Because that sounds incredible. <clears throat> yeah, that sounds that sounds incredible. Might get. I probably won't get it in this series, but I might get that in my um, north, my King in the North series that we're doing tomorrow. Skagos declares war. Okay. You you keep them all busy. I mean, where where are all the armies? How many armies are there? So our largest one is Westerlands. Is is Westerling's army? Gawain Westerling. Prince Kenning's army. So that's probably all the Lords of the Westerlands together, for the most part. Ramsey Snow is in there. Although I can't see Tywin, so he's probably separate, isn't he? Last seen near Coldwater Burn. 
Okay, he's, he's all right. He's he's waging war against um against the veil. It's the perfect opportunity to try and sneak in and take some stuff, but they're so well defended. Case isn't. Because maybe try and take that. Actually, Castle Rock isn't either. But Lannisport is. I don't know if we'd pull anyone with us either. How difficult is it to attract new lords to your cause? After. After you've already gone it alone. Is it still like possible to do or is it pretty difficult and it's more worthwhile to try and improve relations before you kick off? Keltigar is crown lands. Okay. Oh no, it's two hand o'clock and I suck at it. No. Oh, that was terrible. I really do suck. That was that was awful. There will, I'm sure, be a comment saying, Lionheart, put auto block on. But then auto block doesn't teach me to get better at blocking. I must suffer for eternity. And you must suffer watching. <laughs> but he's getting everything. I'm just hoping that he joins me because he's going to be a very powerful lord. I say he's getting everything. It doesn't look like he's actually getting everything, but still. Um, yeah. I'll never get better at two-handed stuff if I don't try. That's my that's my motto. <laughs> Is anyone else as bad at two-handed blocking manually without the auto block as me? Or is it just me? <clears throat> Those pirates probably be good to go after, but I don't want to risk losing any Unsullied needlessly here. I two-handed, I gave up blocking and attack in the hopes that my opponent does. That's, that's what I normally do, yeah. Halt there. Right. Oh. So we can poly a bit, but try... So, yeah, I don't appreciate you coming to attack me. I could try Settler as a duel. Um, we'll fight to the last drop of blood. I don't think you realise, mate, who you're talking to. Nobody just jumps on me. While I'm making a lovely, pleasant trip through your lands to go get some Unsullied. So, Unsullied. Like, just park it. Raise your troops. Just chill. Move. Whoa. I've got some fools to go roast. Come here. How dare you just jump on me like that. <laughs> oh, my moon brother's on fire. How roddy dare you. Nom 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 How many of them are left? Twenty two. I mean, they've actually nearly killed my dragon. Which is very rude of them. 
So they must be toasted. The dragon can be, well, dragon, I, if you, I assume it'll work like any other mount that when you get him to zero, there's a chance to be lame. You, or it can be killed, I guess. Fire. Hold on. Beautiful. Didn't lose anyone. Oh. Tyrion got wounded. Uh, you're, uh, you're free to go because it would give me more charm. I'm taking you all prisoner. Yeah. Yoink. Thanks for your loot. Uh, I'm at war with this plate. I am, so I won't be able to give me pri uh, Nuts. I have to let the prisoners escape then. How dare you think you could just come over here and attack me? That's really rude. No point spending loads of influence against him when he's got the highest chance. What's better than a dragon? Two dragons. <laughs> Four dragons. Five dragons. I'm sensing a theme here. Oh, that is a big old army. I say, so, yeah, maybe the fact that they're at war with these guys over here as well. Oh, you guys are going to need toasting again, aren't you? I think I get my dragon out and they're like, uh oh. Uh, you know what? I'm I'm gonna I challenge you to a duel. Begin the duel. Let's do it. Haha! <laughs> Oh, yeah. Just some light tea bagging. Hee <laughs> hee. Uh, leave. I mean, that all those armies might come after me in a minute, so I'll stay on my dragon in case they are foolish enough to challenge us. Oh, you are foolish. Since you're not. Jewel. I'll jewel you all, damn it. Oh, I see how it is. That's what my plan was. I'm a better shot than you are, mate. That was easy enough. Eee. <laughs> Maybe I should just jewel Bolton. If you keep chasing me, I will burn you. Don't make me do it. Halt. You want no, right, I'll give you one last chance. Duel me one more. Oh, no, you didn't want to duel. Oh, dear. So you have chosen death. On my command. Sword for cavalry. Move. How very foolish. Yeah. Troops, form a shield wall. Crispy Cav, Crispy Cav, does whatever a Crispy Cav does. Ow. It's 
Save yourselves, I would. Yep, Tyrion just got taken out again. Um, nom 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 You fools. You fools. Nom 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 nom. I somehow managed to hit that guy. I don't think so. I think it was just counts my mount, right? <laughs> Dracaris. Oh, there's still a few of them back there, are there? Oh, did I finish him? What well on Bron? That's a bit of influence gain, remember now? Uh you're free to go. You're free to go. Is that you? Am I free? You're fine, Justin Massey. No thanks, unnecessary. Uh oh, they're willing to give me some troops. Um Valerian Sea Guard, Dragon Sea uh -huh. I was going to go get Unsullied. So. Because if I send Brienne off here, she'll be stuck over here. That's my only thought. So. I'm not going to take anyone. No. Nope. I'll just take the swag. Alright. But it's taking us so long. Let's head to the sea. See if that'll be quicker. And we've got some skill points. Go for that one. No, go for that one. Mountain patrols. Charm. That one. And Morton Engineer. Okay. Oh. Next time, leave all the horses at home. Herding penalty is basically we've got way too many horses in our party and not enough men to ride them. Uh, Zanabajo of the Summer Isles. Cool. Halt. Good for you. Hello. You will burn. You fool. You fool. I'm on a freaking dragon. Cue the Game of Thrones music. Crispy troops from Volantis. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Well, they're actually doing some damage to my dragon. Munch them all. Stop. 
stop shooting my dragon. I mean, so not, if enough of them focused on me, they could probably uh, kill me dragon. Oh, no. I just torched Tyrion by mistake. Sorry, Tyrion. I think he's only wounded. Yeah, he's fine. He's just wounded. He's just crispy Lannister. Um, attack again. I'm gonna attack again, have I? Sorry, Tyrion. Three, two, one. Fireball! Well, that's a terrible time to be a recruit. Sliced and diced by Heartsbane. Um, you're free to go. Because I want the charm. I give up. I yield. Grant you're... me the honors of war and do yourself credit. You're a bit of a douche. Does he have any a unique axe or is that just a normal one? I might see if he's got a unique axe. Hey. No, oh, I can't do anything about that. Uh, I can't take any more prisoners either. Oh. Lordly Tiger Cloak Helm. That's kind of weird and cool at the same time. Yeah, I'll take all that. There you go. Does he have anything... Uh, I don't know why I'm clicking on that. Oh? Yep. <laughs> Tyrion, so you don't look so crispy now. Um. Why are you guys wanting his blood so much? Um. Execute. Chippity. Is he the lead? Is he the leader of Atlantis? I assume they'll all hate me. I might want some of their lords to... Oh? Um, you're free to go. Come at me again and I'll, I'll annihilate you. Yeah, I don't want to ruin my charm. Just thought you might have a cool axe or something. Well, it won't ruin my charm, will it? But it'll ruin my reputation, which we've built up with all our charming events. New owner of the bloody gate. Oh, it's me. That's a castle in the veil I do not want. Oh, did I just vote for that as well? I create. I, yeah, I tried to give it to him. Give it away. Don't want. Give it to this boy. Hopefully Justin Massey um, helps me out after all this. I've been pretty good to him. Oh, herding penalty. I'm sorry. I forgot about the... We won't have this problem on the way back because so we'll have loads of Unsullied. I've influence farmed a bit. Come on. Pasta on the ships. Is 
sit back and enjoy the ride. One one is free. When did one when did one one get picked up? Uh one one. Oh Hodor can just go straight out in his own party. Yeah, give you a wager that much. Let's just see if he can start building up again. That's the doom of Valyria, right? Because I'm assuming big old volcano erupted and killed everyone. But uh, Al Pono of the Dothraki declares war. Keep. Yeah, good thing that Astapor isn't one of our enemies, to be fair, because otherwise we'd be in trouble. Well, I'd have to just leave the Lannisters now, I guess. Right. Speak to the good master. Hello. I would like a hundred on Salid. Uh, I'm pretty sure I can have like a few more. I think I can have... Maybe like a couple more than that. I don't know. How many have I got? Oh, I'm, I'm over by four. One, two, three, four. I've got 185 unsullied. Noise. Thanks, mate. Pleasure doing business with you. Uh, Tavern District Ransom. And Astapor, surely you're pretty rich. Not as rich as I'd like you to be. It's a lovely place to come get some tasty rewards. That'll do for now. Thank you. I guess be rude not to do a tournament while we're here. Oh, black card. I do. Oh, no. I wanted that in my King in the North. Well, not my King in the North. My North Remembers series. Let's at least try and win it in this one. Who was that? Oh, it's Jamie. It's like, I recognize that Lannister armor. Yeah, Jamie! Oh, it's Jamie and Bronn. Quite the pairing. Was Brienne of Tarth.
Got him. Final round, sword and shield should have it. Got him. Ooh. Got it. How good is that axe? I forget. Not, not bad, in fact. To the rather tasty chap. Um, not quite as good as Heartsbane. But pretty good damage. I wouldn't mind having that in my uh I mean North Remembers campaign. Right, let's head back. We're not gonna have the herding penalty anymore. Thank the gods for that. We're nice and speedy. Let's head back to King's Landing. And Harren Hall by extension. So we can see ever gold in action. Which one's that? Shouldn't need my dragon, but I'll stay on my dragon until we're clear of Essos. Because I don't want to risk losing Unsullied. Yes, yeah, so now I want to head back, recruit a load of troops from Lannisport, and build up a good solid Lannister themed army as well. We really go for this. Hodor, you got some troops. Good. Um oh. Oops. Oh, stop trying to uh, they're all they're gonna try and give me everything now, aren't they? I'm just gonna go straight through and give it away each time. <clears throat> Gives me another opportunity, I guess, to improve relations and build up my charm. How come they want to give me everything? Um, probably because all their other lords, I would imagine, have got like multiple um, multiple regions, multiple settlements now. And I've just got Harrenhal. And I'm planning on leaving the kingdom soon, so I don't really want any other territory given to me right now. Yeah, it, it, the AI always tries to even it out eventually. If you've uh, not got that, not got as much as other lords, but eventually you'll show up in the options. At least 190, uh, well, it's 185 unsullied is a fairly intimidating sight, so they're not interested in uh, in fighting me. Nom 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 nom. The only problem is. Everyone's everyone and their mums joining the Westerlands. All of you clubbed together, you could probably have a go at them, but I guess not. Did they ever take Haraway? No. Surely the Eerie at this rate is going to be under siege because they're they're storming on through and taking the castles over there. But yeah, I guess we need to decide whether we're going to carve out any territory before. Um, before we uh, go off the Lannisters. I mean, like taking the Arbor could be potentially fun. That's Dawn. 
Don't want to be caught between multiple. Uh, I think I think I'll just go for I'll just go for Lannisport. I think and just see if anyone joins me or not. If they don't, they don't. If they do, they do. Oh yeah, one one is probably available to be sent off now, isn't he? One one. Yeah, there you go, mate. Off you go. Uh, actually, I can send out Brienne now because I can just give her. Um, I mean, how many troops can I have? Ninety. Cancel. We'll wait till I picked up my other troops because then we'll get. I'll probably. I'll probably keep a hundred. Unsullied for myself. Then I'll make the rest of my army up as archers and cavalry. Go collect the rest of my troops from Harren Hall. I mean, we need to actually empty Harren Hall before we leave the kingdom because we'll be giving it back, won't we, when we leave? I can come off my dragon now. Check it's still there, actually. Okay, manage garrison. Um, do, do, do. Lannister levy. No, actually, we don't need Lannister. We don't need Lannister infantry, do we? We want. Any crossbows. Okay, 30 of them. Uh, Westland's Banner Knight. Yeah, take them. Oh, yeah, we'll give, we'll give her the Tarth Warrior. Yeah, we'll take the Castle of Champions as well. That's fine. There's 177 in there. You can keep all the settlements you, uh, if you leave. Only downside is war. Yeah. Yeah, the thing is, like, Harren Hall's not really the settlement I want to try and hold on to. It's like, it's always a constant um, battleground, to be fair. So I'm quite happy leaving that and losing it. It's the only one I've gained. All right, Brienne. Have your Tarthman. And then... There we go. That's oh, like I should have taken you more out, actually. Yeah. That's fine. You'll recruit the rest you need. That'll get you started comfortably. Um, Unlimited ways. Turn that off. Boom. Nice. All right. I will go back to the Westlands and fill out my army. So we've got 34 crossbows. Um, I would quite like to make that like 50, I think. And then the rest cavalry. 40 cav. Well, no, it'll be less than that, won't it? It'll be 35 cav. Because we've got, oh no, uh, 36 cav. With my companions included. And then we kick off. I mean, we are going to be at war with them, I guess. But if we do want to take another territory first. Uh, things like Harren Hall's... If, if I'm going to go straight to war with the Lannisters, then I want... Um, I want to take Castle Rock and like siege that straight away. Pretty much... So, yeah, I don't want to be distracted by Harren Hall. Although, I guess they could go and attack it, couldn't they? But still. I yeah, will avoid it for now. How do I how do I get people to join me? Do I have to go talk to them all? Or is there an easier way I can be like, Hey, you lot this way. 
It's going to be to me, isn't it? Go in here. No, go in there. Go to the bottom. Give it away. Yep. Goodbye. Okay, if I run into them, they, they'll join me rather than... Or I have the option of saying, hey, join me rather than fighting me. Um, well, that'll probably do the cav. So leave that. We have got the best war chest in the world, but we've got another one. And what we want to do, oh, there's Hodor. Great minds think alike, Hodor. There's Brienne. And where is 1-1? One -one? I'm assuming he's up in the north somewhere. Oh, no, 1-1's one over here. Oh, shit, let's take all of them. I could have six more. Would you give me 40 archers? And I can just leave it as is. Yeah, go on then. They're just Westerland recruits. Okie dokie. There are white walkers in this mod, yep. We have burnt many of them alive. We won our last tourney. Will we manage to do it again? Oh, I should look see if there's some new armor here as well. Take that. I really love this Tali armor. As plain as it is, it's big and bulky and I like it. Uh oh. Oh, nearly. But I'm still through the next round. Let's take out Jamie. So Ben Free the Lucky, you won't be lucky after I'm done with you. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, just missed him.
Got him. Oi, oi, oi. That was me versus Jamie again. Oh! Oh, he just... Did he just couch me or did he just lance me for a really good amount of damage? I'm in twobble now. Very low on health. Versus Hodor. I didn't realise Hodor was here. Oh, of course, he's, he's at Lannisport. Bad Hodor. I am your lord. Let me win. about this tournament and etiquette you bugger ah. I'll have words with you Hodor I will have words what were we even fighting for I can't even remember anymore right well we have got the last few troops to level up I think we'll go level them up over in the Kingswood, because there's some pretty decent troops to face there. It should be easy enough for us to take them out with unsullied support. Hopefully we'll get some spread of uh, XP. And then we can kick off our kingdom and see what happens. Short-lived or a new realm established for a long, long time to come. We'll find out. 10% of the total experience gained as a bonus to infantry after battles. Oh, that's good. Uh, plus two daily experience to infantry in your party. 10% uh, of total experience gained as a bonus to infantry after battles. That would be, would that be bonus of what I gain as well? Yeah, let's go for that. Sounds, that sounds good. Um, yes, yeah, increase that a little bit and a bit more in engineering. Uh, yeah. We'll just head over there. Might see if we can have one quick battle to finish up. And then we'll have to continue this next time. Which will probably be like an hour of it or so on Friday. Oh, we can we can hunt down those bandits. Hello. Oh, never mind, let you go. Just because I wanna see you in the daylight. It's always more fun to fight in daylight. There we go. Die. Under my command. Oh, it's a bridge. Oh, wonderful. That's gonna be that's gonna be absolutely disgusting. Boss. That's gonna be a lot of fun. All I need to do is tell my crossbows to chill here. Soldiers! Troops! Make it soldiers! Shield wall across there. Oh, it's going to be spectacular. Oh, you can see there's a castle up there. Never seen that before on this map. Or well, never noticed it. I fought a few times on this map, though. And Salad. And Bron. Look at that. Soldiers! Hold for Bowman! Hold arrow! Archers! Forward! Yeah! Archers! Move! Archers! 
I mean, they're probably all going to stay at range, aren't they? Because they're missile troops, but still. That's pretty awesome. Whoa! Oh, I meant to check Atlantis bought some armor, didn't I? We'll have to do that shopping to start with next time. Bowman! Got to go shopping. Arrow! Fire! Troops! Fire! Oh, beautiful. Okay, that, that, that's pretty incredible. Oh, absolutely destroying them. Oh, that is devastating. Glorious. Well, so ends another adventure for Tyran. Next time, once we level up the last of our troops here and do a little bit of shopping, we'll be breaking off and going after Lannis Fort and Castle Rock, see if we can establish ourselves there and see if we can hold off the inevitable counterattack from the Westerlands. Uh, see how many of them we can pull to our side or whether we get snuffed out or whether we just have to burn a lot of them in dragon fire that'll be what we do we'll keep on marching you ride back to Lannis port to do some shopping next time but if you're watching over on youtube i hope you've enjoyed another episode until the next one take care and ciao for now